had a chance. We you play these games, you got to jump on. You got to take advantage of your opportunities. We got opportunities early. Um, we moved the ball offensively. We got a huge turnover on our punt team. We throw a pick in the red zone again. Um, takes points. So even three nothing there makes difference. We just again we moved the ball. Our defense didn't have to play a lot in the first half. They played great, but our offense did what we thought we potentially could do is mix it up enough and, and get some first downs and move the football. We had ball in plus territory. Should be a two-score advantage. Us, they're kind of sleepwalking through it a little bit, you know, and it's hard. It's hard if you're at Notre Dame, you're playing Miami, Ohio. It's just hard. Those kids those kids didn't get recruited by Miami, Ohio. Like, you can say whatever you want. You think it's an easy job. No, it's not an easy job. You're like, you get them excited. Like, oh, yeah, but they just lost two. Yeah, I know. I got you. But still Miami, Ohio. And they watch it on tape. And we don't look like we don't look like the teams they play, you know. Um, but again, that was our chance. We had our chance early first, second quarter to be up 10-0, 13-0, whatever. And, and, and again, just self-inflicted wounds is very frustrating. I thought our defense defended the run really good. They got really good backs, including their quarterback. Like, they can run it. They do some really good stuff in the run game. I thought our kids really fought. Obviously, they, they lost some old linemen, probably a factor, but I still like the way our kids, we not get knocked off the ball there. Um, didn't get open. We, you know, they played a lot of man. We didn't get open. They won the battle of man. Their DBs against us. Um, they do a good job getting hands on you, and we couldn't we couldn't really play all that man, and you don't make them pay. It's 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 it can be a long day. So, but had our opportunities early and didn't didn't cash in, and um, just disappointed to be honest with you. All right, questions. Coach, I think you were focusing on wanting to make sure that the running game got better, and I felt like you guys did that today. Can you kind of compliment yeah, on that? Yeah, I thought we ran it good. They're 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 physical physical group. I thought I thought we ran it probably better, to be honest, better than I thought we would, you know. Um, uh, but we, we, our guys, our guys worked hard all week and we got some things going there and it was, there was, there was at least enough air there. We weren't behind the chains, you know what I mean? At least it was second eight, second seven, second four we had. So yeah, we, we ran it, we ran it. I'm pleased with how we ran. I'm pleased how we ran, how we defend the run. I know they hit a couple, a couple late, but um, we got them in enough third downs and we knew if we get them a third down, okay, we got to win third down against their offense, you know. And we did it for you know the first first two and a half quarters. Coach, this is the third straight game where you guys have played well, but not exactly gotten the result you want. How do you uh, communicate to the team to keep going, even though it's the record doesn't yeah. show the effort? Yeah, if I had that answer, I'd write a really good book, <laughs> help a lot of people out when things don't go well. It's not. It's just. It's. I would say I just go back to my upbringing, whenever you know. Whenever it doesn't go you want, I always just think of my mom and dad and how they raised me, and you don't got to make excuses, and you could quit, but you didn't live in that house anymore if you're going to quit. So, I mean, that's it's all we know. It's 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 hard. We have really high expectations this year, and we're 0 three. You know, really high. We're coming off a great team. We got a lot of guys back. We're good, like, I think people can see we got the shot to be a good football team. But at the end of the day, you're 0 three. No one like, no one, no one looks to see who you play. No one cares who you play. They just we're 0 three, you know. And so it's it's a, it's a very frustrated group in there. It's a very disappointed group in there. And we got we got a lot of work to do. And we got we got you know we got a good, a good team coming in next week that handled Toledo. Didn't beat Toledo, but again, the easy thing for us will be well, we're not playing a Power Five team. We'll be okay because last year we we're pretty good against non Power Five teams, right? You know, well that's, that's the trap you fall in. And and we're we're mentally like it takes a lot. Like we're mentally and physically. You know, we don't have a lot left. Like, you know, our, our our quarterback's been hit a lot in three weeks. You know, and it's physical toll. He he won't feel good tomorrow, but he got hit a bunch today now. Uh, but he got hit a bunch against Northwestern. Got hit a bunch against Cincinnati. You know, well, you're trying to win games. You know, and he's a competitor, and we're fighting and scratching and clawing. And so, but it's a mental toll too. It's just like you, you try so hard, you work your whole life, and you go through, and you have high expectations, and you're going three. It just it, it's again. So I. I don't have a great answer other than we got we don't we don't have a choice, you know. You can take this collectively today or the last three games. What do you take out of this as you're approaching Mac play? Yeah, like we say every time, like you play Notre Dame, you play Northwestern, you play every mistake gets exposed. Like you're not where you're supposed to go, Ryan Leonard goes fifty yards for a touchdown. It's like it's over, you know, like so you know, that's the only take is like what we do well, okay, we've done we've done a lot of things well the first three weeks, so we gotta we gotta kind of hone in and say, okay, because you always want to play to your strengths. Like, okay, if we've done this well against three power five opponents, probably something we should be pretty good at. Let's keep, let's keep getting better at that and let's play to what, who we are. 
Um, and then the other thing is the negative. Okay, who, what's been exposed? What can't? What aren't we very good at? Which you get exposed in a hurry on days like today. Chuck, two minutes to go in the half. You're down seven three. At that point, with all the game plan that you put together, how close are you to? Kind of having the game in yeah, a spot where you want. It, it's frustrating because we should be up 13 to 7. That, I was so frustrated. Like, we just can't, like, it felt great about how we played. It felt great. Like, it was just scored, but we need to get that lead and we needed to have Notre Dame play from behind. We needed to, they got some booze in the second quarter, you know, they had a punt, got like, but we needed to get that lead and turn up the pressure. And there's pressure here as we, anybody follows this place knows, like, 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 the news can t tighten in a hurry. And, you know, coming off two weeks, I was like, if we just have a lead and make them play from behind a little bit, maybe they make a couple of errors, you know. So just frustrated because we did what we wanted to. We had opportunities, and we didn't take advantage of the opportunities. Your your guys and their ability to sort of, like, focus on, I think you say, like, writing their own story, not not worry about expectations. How, how do you feel like they handled that today after last week? Yeah, we were ready to roll. Like, I feel great how we came out of the shoot. I had, we had a good week of practice. I felt like every, like – First half, we had to move the ball. We're moving the ball. We're getting like it for a period there. And I, again, I didn't. I wasn't delusional thinking like, but I felt like we were in control of the game. Like this couldn't have gone better to script. Um, and again, I just like I watched last week talk like three and out, three and out, three and out, three and out. We can't do that. Like we and their defense is so stingy. So it's like we were moving it like, and we were getting in plus territory, and our defense was sitting on the sidelines. And it was like, okay, now you got your points. Like we talked, we talked in the. You know the meeting before the game. We're only gonna have five or six opportunities to really put them in a bind, and you gotta cash in. We didn't cash in on Ava, offensively. You know, the, so that was felt good about how we were playing, but just felt like God. We even at that point felt like God. We did. We kind of our opportunity was right there, and we didn't take it. You know, not not until we were trying to take. We just didn't execute. You know, and they're good and they make plays. And you know, I say a lot of it has to do with the air team too. That's why we didn't do what we're supposed to. But.